This is the PowerTeacher Pro Copying Assignments Tutorial. So you've been working in PowerTeacher for a while, and you've got one of your subjects set up with the assignments that you're going to use. And you want to use the same assignments in other subject areas or other sections of the course, and you don't want to have to recreate those assignments all the time. There's an option in PowerTeacher Pro that allows you to copy your assignments and reuse them in other sections of other courses. So I'm here in PowerTeacher Pro in my assignment list for my ELA 6 class. I've got it set up to use single mark entry, and I've got one assignment created for each progress report as we go through the year. And I want to set this up with the rest of my classes, so I'm going to use the same strategy for mark entry, and I don't want to have to go into each subject and recreate these assignments. So here's what I can do. I can come over and I can click on the gear icon. It's just to the left of your term selector. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to choose copy assignments. The copy assignments window opens. Now there are several pieces to this window, so let's walk our way through it. In the first set, we are setting the from class. So what that means is we are choosing the class that already has the assignment set up that we want to copy from. So first thing we set is the term. Now I've got assignments that span the entire year, so I am going to choose the entire year from this drop down. What you choose depends on how your classes are set up and what the time span is for the classes that you want to copy from. I'm going to choose the full year, and then I would choose the class that I want to copy my settings from, which in my case is this ELA 6 class. So I'm going to click on that. The next thing I need to do is choose where I want to copy assignments to. So I'm clicking here on scheduling term. I'm copying from one full year class to another full year class, so I'm going to choose full year. And then I need to choose here from the classes drop down where I want to copy those assignments to. Now here's the thing with this. You can see that it's possible to copy assignments from a single setup to multiple different classes. The problem that that presents is when you do it that way, those assignments that are created are all linked to each other. So if you make a change in one assignment in one class, it changes all of the assignments in all of the classes. Because of that, we don't recommend you copy from one class to many classes. We recommend you copy from one class to one other class. So I'm going to click here on the ART6. I'm going to click just outside of that drop down to get it to collapse. The next thing we need to set is how the due dates copy forward. I'm going to click on the due dates drop down. If you choose existing, that means the due dates that are set in the current assignments that we're copying will copy over to the new copy exactly the same as they're set. Relational means that the due dates will be copied into the new assignments at about the same spot in the term as what's set up. Or you can choose custom and set specifically what you want it to be. Because I'm copying from one full year class to another full year class in the same reporting year, I'm going to leave it at existing. The last thing we need to set is what assignments we're copying. I want to copy all of my assignments down, so I'm going to click on the checkbox at the top of the column to select all four assignments that are in that list. And then I come down here in the bottom right-hand corner and I click on Copy Assignments. And I can see there the notification that four assignments were copied. And then I'll repeat the process to copy to my other classes. Make sure this is set for full year. I'm going to take the settings of the assignments from that ELA 6 class. I'm going to come to the two settings, set it for the full year, and then choose the class I want to copy to next. Now again, it's really tempting to select multiple classes here, so you only have to do this once. But remember, if you choose to do that, you're creating a linked assignment, and any change that you make in the assignment in one of the classes that they're linked together with, then you change for all of them. And that's a running a pretty big risk for you, so it's not what we recommend. I'm going to keep with my existing due dates. I'm going to select all the assignments because I want to copy them over, and then I'm going to copy assignments. Copying assignments allows you to create assignments in one class and then reuse them in other classes, actually copy them over so you can use them in other classes. Remember, we only recommend you copy from one class to one other class, but it'll save you a bunch of time. If you have any questions, please reach out to the help desk.